Inside the Lines Playoffs Edition is sponsored by DraftKings. Hi, welcome to SBR Forum Videos. We are previewing the divisional round of the NFL playoffs right now. We are talking with returning guest Troy West from AllPlaysWin.com. Troy West had a great year with us during the regular season in uh, college football, bowl season, and the NFL. And uh, then he came back for the NFL playoffs. And the NFL playoffs is, you know, a little bit of a different animal. He took two games last week, so, you know, you never know how things will change from the regular season to uh, the playoffs. For Troy West, they did not change at all. Two games last week, 2-0 and against the spread. Unbelievable. Troy West, thanks for being back back with us thanks a lot peter you know you know what I, i'm not usually the cocky kind of guy but we're rocking it at allplayswin.com hey. we're doing it in all sports we crushed it in the bowl game two and oh two games that weren't really close i know i know seattle played washington close there for for about two quarters but realistically that was a blowout in the making we're on fire we're hitting yeah. at a high rate in the nba as well too pete so that some of these guys that watch these videos come on board we're, we're doing good things over here i mean what can i say you know i was all prepared to be like all right thank you for taking two games you know you went one and one or oh and two but it's you know it's the playoffs these are tough tough lines you did great in the regular season it doesn't really matter that much but i don't have to two and oh against the spread again troy west it's unbelievable i, I don't know what to say I, I just i want these people to understand this is the real deal we've been <laughs> the doing real it deal. 12, 13 weeks. If we were a one, two week show, we're going to keep rolling. All right. I feel great about the two games we got in this week for the guys out there. I don't know how you feel great about them. They're tight, tight lines, but we'll see what you have to say. Again, Troy's website, allplayswin.com. His record in these videos uh, speaks for itself. All right, Green Bay at San Francisco is the first game you are going to take. San Francisco, two and a half or three point uh, home favorite. The total is 44 and a half. Green Bay, of course, playing great on fire. They're, uh, they're only 10 and 7 against the spread on the year, but they're 9 and 3 against the spread over their last 12, and they had some injuries during the regular season, but now they're getting healthy on both offense and defense. The Niners, though, 9-7 and seven against the spread, but, you know, a great team with a week of rest. Small small line. Uh, you know, this is probably going to be a tough smash-mouth game, so I don't know what side you would lean towards here. What do you like, Troy West? I think you hit it on the nose, and that's what the team I'm going with is San Francisco <laughs> because it is going to be a tough dog fight, and I think San Francisco – and you look at these NFL playoffs, good defenses, teams that can run the football are tending to win these type of games. And I like San Francisco. I know it was 17, 18 weeks ago, but San Francisco went into Lambeau and dominated that Green Bay team. I think there, it's a tough, tough matchup for Aaron Rodgers, a team that's depending on the pass, going to get the phenomenal secondary in San Francisco. Aaron Rodgers' offensive line struggles against the pass rush. I think San Francisco's had a week to get healthy, a week to prepare. Hardbox a phenomenal coach. I expect San Francisco ready to play at home, and I expect them to beat Green Bay. I think Aaron Rodgers is a great quarterback. just don't think he's got the weapons and the help that he needs up front. I don't think his receivers are where they need to be. They don't have much of a running game. I know they look good their last few games. I think San Francisco with the week to prepare – Healthy at home, San Francisco wins this football game. Wow, yeah, I mean, the last few games, uh, Green Bay's looked awesome. I mean, they just have one of those programs that you can trust, you know? So it's like they've been 9-3 and three against the spread uh, over their last 12 weeks, and they're just one of those teams that I'm always tending on either, you know, betting on or passing, not betting against. But then again, you know, San Francisco is such a powerhouse. I mean, this line looks to me straight, like, dead flat on. But, uh, but you think there's actually some value here with the Niners? I do. I just think, you know, the Niners still have a chip on their shoulder for what happened last year against the Giants. I think the 49ers are a team that are looking to get back to the Super Bowl. To me, they're the best team in the NFC. I know they slipped up a few times there late in the season, once against Seattle, and then they struggled against St. Louis a couple times. But this is a team, for the most part, that's dominated everybody, and they've dominated teams at home. Their defense plays much better at home as well. I just don't see Green Bay going in. I don't think this is the Green Bay team of the past where they're lighting teams up 30, 40 points with Jordy Nelson and all those guys. Nelson's still banged up. I just don't think Aaron Rodgers gets it done. He's been sacked a lot this year. The 49ers will dial up several different blitzes. I think the 49ers win this football game pretty handily. I think they win by a touchdown, but I think they're in cruise control all game long. I really all do. right. Well, there you go. I couldn't handicap this game, but uh, I'm damn good at handicapping the handicappers on our shows. And if Troy West says San Francisco's aside, I'm convinced. San Francisco minus three. I'll give you two and a half because two and a half is available out there if you go line shopping. Thanks so much, Troy West. Great preview as always. Thank you, Pete.